Well, they were trapped, covered in feces, and living in conditions not even fit for human. But tonight, more than a dozen golden retrievers are on the mend. Columbus Humane rescued these dogs from a hoarding situation, and now the owner is facing charges. New at 6, 10TV's Brittany Bailey has an update after getting a first look at the animals. You may remember this rescue. Columbus Humane agents would not even go into this new Albany home without being covered head to toe in protective bodysuits. But a woman and 21 animals were living inside. No one should be like, should have been in that environment, you know, living themselves, let alone the animals. Inside, they say they found deplorable conditions and dogs living in several inches of feces, trash and food scraps. 18 of those dogs were golden retrievers. The initial response automatically is like, I need to pick this thing up and get it out of here. It just was, you know, um, a lot of, lot of dogs, a lot of, um, you know, sanitation concerns. Um, I mean, I've seen a lot, you know, doing this job, but um, it's definitely, it never gets easier every time you do it. The agents rescued all of the animals, 20 dogs and one cat. And the owner is now facing 11 charges in Franklin County Municipal Court. Agents say this was a case of hoarding. A lot of the times it could be, you know, they just get overwhelmed with the number of animals that they have or, you know, something in their life has gone, you know, not necessarily great and then it kind of spirals. Um, hoarding is not just animals, it can be uh, things and uh, possessions as well. So it affects um, every community, every neighborhood. It, it does not discriminate. We can't show you the dogs right now because they're still considered evidence in the court case. But I did get a chance to pop in and see them and I can tell you they're all extremely cute. But many are still very timid and have a long recovery ahead of them. A lot of them had like some matting and um, which causes um, can cause like sores and um, pulling of the skin and things like that is very painful. Um, so we are um, working on remedying that, um, but that was the big thing was matting. Columbus Humane did provide us some pictures and videos of a couple of the recovered dogs. We're told if and when they can be adopted, they will need patient and caring owners. And these dogs definitely need um, the time to settle in and become the dogs they were meant to be. Brittany Bailey, 10 TV News. Mm. Well, Columbus Humane wants to remind you that if you think an animal is in trouble, you can call for help. And that number is easy to remember. It's just 614-777-PETS. Be their voice because they can't speak up for themselves.